Anthony here from Clarioscope. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me today. Uh, just a quick haul. I picked up a few things from uh, Target, uh, CVS, and Walgreens. And I wanted to show you guys what I picked up since it was a little bit of a mishmash. A few things here, a few things there, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Um, let me just get started so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. The first thing I found finally was this EOS uh, hand lotion in Berry Blossom. EOS hand lotion in Berry Blossom. Um, there was an open one in the store, i got to be honest with you, and I smelled it, and it smelled so, so good. I've heard really, really good things about this. Uh, they only had this one flavor, though, so I got this one to see what it would be like, and I think I'm going to really like it, although I'm pretty sure my wife's going to take this and put it in her purse. That's fine. It's not really the most manly thing to put in my pocket, but it smells really good, so that was Next kind of the things whole I found point. when I was at CVS. Uh, the first of which actually surprised me. This is the Real Techniques uh, shading brush with the Bonus Fine Liner brush, which is kind of funny because I've never seen the one with the Bonus Fine Liner brush. And two brushes basically for the price of one. Couldn't go wrong. I love these Real Technique brushes. I have a whole video of the brushes and the uh, eyeshadow sets that I picked up. So keep an eye out for that. That'll be coming up pretty soon. Um, but I couldn't pass it up. It was only like $8, so that was a great deal. The next thing I saw when I was there is this new Garnier uh, BBI Miracle Skin Perfector. It's a daily eye roller. It says corrects dark circles, minimizes puffiness, awakens skin, even skin tone, and hydrates in the color fair to light. Um, there weren't that many of those there at the store, so I did actually pick up two of them because the Garnier was on sale at the time. I believe it was only like 25% off, but uh, like I said, every penny makes a big difference, especially with these new things. This is on a display at the front, so I picked these up right away when I saw them. This is something new, like I said, it's the BBI Perfector to revive tired eyes. Oops. The next thing I found was at Target, it is the Sonia Kashuk Eye on Neutral Matte Shimmer. It was on sale on clearance, actually. It was regular price, $31.99. It's now $15.98. This is the limited edition one that came out at Christmas time. This is the one Eye on Neutral. Uh, and like I said, this is the price right here. $15.98 on sale. Um, how can you possibly go wrong with that? This is a beautiful thing. You know, the Sonia Kashuk. Everyone always picks them up, and like I said, I saw this at Christmas time, and I was like, there's no way I'm paying $32 for it. But uh, for $16, I wanted to get more than one. I just couldn't find more than one that hadn't been opened and touched. So I got this one. I know my wife's going to be very, very happy with this. So Thanks that's something new. CVS. This is the Ardell Corset Lashes. Uh, lashes laced with attitude, it says. This is the Ardell 505 Black. 505 Black. That's the first one. Then there's the 501 black. Look at that. That is wicked. And some special occasion lashes if ever I saw them. There's the 500 black. Like I said, these are the corset lashes. Um, I'm sure they still have them in stock because it was pretty recently I picked these up. Uh, this is 504 black. Then we have 502 black. 502 black. That looks like an everyday kind of lash if you ask me. Uh, I have another 504 black right here. 504 black. I think that was the most natural looking one with the uh, crisscross shape that my wife always uses. And then 503 black. So those are something new, like I said. Um, I'd only just seen these come out. I know there was another one, another style, but it wasn't quite what I was looking for. So uh, I know my wife will use all of these. Uh, so another thing those I found up. when I was Target is this Pixie set. This is the Eye Alchemy Assortment from Pixie. Uh, it was on clearance. It was $30 or $29.99. It's now $14.98. So it's right there, $14.98. And this is the Pixie set right here. It's upside down, is it? So the Pixie set, sorry, it was upside down. Uh, looks like this. It was a eyeshadow set. Uh, Eye Alchemy Assortment Metallic Magic. 36 metallic eyeshades and a dual ended brush. Like I said, this was only $15, so what a great deal. I did see something similar to this Christmas time, and like I said, for $30, I really couldn't see myself getting it, but for $15, definitely. What a great deal that is. The next brand I saw, um, I didn't, I can honestly say I've never even heard of it until now, is called Bonnie Bell. 
Um, they only had a few things. They had some lipsticks, some lip lacquers, and a nail polish. All they had was uh, nail one nail polish, which is in this color right here, um, Miami, which is this uh, glittery gold color right here, Miami, if it focuses on there. Uh, that is the one nail color that I could find. They had a few different lip lacquers. This one is in Pina Colada. Pina Colada. This is Bonnie Bell. Like I said, I've never even heard of this brand. Uh, first time I seen it was on this display. The next one I have here is Bellini. This is Bellini in the lip lacquer from Bonnie Bell. And the third one I found is this pink one with these gold flecks in it. This one's called Daiquiri. It's a beautiful color lip lacquer. And um, also, for that matter, on this display, there was three uh, lipsticks. I was about to say nail polishes. There's three lipsticks on there. This first one being Flamingo Pink. Which I don't know if you see that color. Flamingo Pink right there. Flamingo Pink. The second one of which was Calypso Coral. Calypso Coral. It's got a bright coral color in there. And the third color is Hollywood Beige, which is actually this pinky beige right here. You can see that right there, pinky beige. Uh, like I said, if anybody knows anything about Bonnie Bell or can tell me anything about it, please write to me down below or drop me a line. Um, I actually have never heard of this before, so. You know, if there's other things out there that can find, or if there's a place I could find these, please, please do let me know. I'm actually very interested in finding some more of this line. Uh, the next thing I found out about recently, and of course, I don't really pick up too many things from Burt's Bees um, on a regular basis, but I'd seen these lip crayons, and I think I'd gotten one somewhere. I'm not sure if it was from a CW box and Birch box or otherwise. Uh, but these lip crayons, my wife had tried one, and she loved it, so I figured I would pick up some. This one is in Hawaiian Smolder. Hawaiian Smolder. Flip ground from Birch Bees. This next one is Napa Vineyard. Napa Vineyard. We have Redwood Forest. Redwood Forest, another nice beautiful red. This one is Niagara Overlook. Niagara Overlook. Great names. Uh, Sedona Sands. This next beautiful pink one, Sedona Sands. And finally, bright pink one is Carolina Coast. Carolina Coast. And like I said, um, we tried one of these. I'm not sure what box it came in, but it was definitely in a box from somewhere. Uh, and she tried it out and really loved them, so I figured I'd just pick them all up. And luckily there was just a few colors, and it's a very, very full display. If you've ever seen those Burt's Bees displays, they do keep them very well stocked. And there's just a whole assortment of stuff from makeup to they have hand creams, lip products, skin products, a whole vast assortment of things. So it was a little overwhelming, but I went in there for one thing, and that is what I got. The final thing I picked up when I was there was this display uh, from Sally Hansen called I Heart Nail Art. Um, these are pens, I Heart Nail Art pens. This first one is a turquoise pen. I think these are the fine ones I picked up. The turquoise pen right here. I Heart Nail Art. Then I picked up a white one, of course. Gotta get the white one. Uh, a yellow one, because, you know, like I said, if you go and do nail art, you gotta have all the colors. A lavender one, or it's called it purple. It looks more lavender to me. Purple. A silver one, because, you know, who doesn't want a little bit of flash on their nails? Silver one right there. A red one. Like I said, these are all in fine, just so my wife can do uh, special small designs on her nails. I picked up the blue one. Uh, a pink one, of course. What person does their nails doesn't want pink? And finally, I picked up the black one also. Like I said, these uh, were new as far as I know. I look at the Sally Hansen nail display all the time, and I'd never seen them before. And uh, like I said, I know my wife loves to do nail art on her own nails. So I figured, why not? What a good time to pick it up. Uh, Sally Hansen was buy one, get one half price. And, uh, you know, with that kind of deal, who wouldn't pick them all up? Um, that's all I picked up from this particular collective haul from several different places. Uh, I just want to show you guys before we start opening them up and playing around with them, testing them out, seeing how they work. 
If you have any questions on anything, please don't forget to comment down below. Ask me. I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can. Uh, don't forget, you can also get in touch with me on my social media, Instagram and Twitter at Claudioscope. Also on Facebook at Claudioscope Anthony Collard. Don't forget, you can also write to me via snail mail. I do uh, love to get postcards from you guys, see where you live. Like I said, I live in Hawaii, so I'm a little jaded as far as those beautiful beaches. But you can send me all the places you guys have been, all the places you're going to. I really would appreciate it. I do write back as soon as I get the letters. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I love and appreciate you guys more than you could possibly know. I'll be really seeing you soon. Thank you so very much. You guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you soon.